What's happening, ghoulies? Welcome back to the Voina Experience. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Ghoulies, we are but a couple of weeks away from the big day, ghoulies. Halloween is coming up very soon, and we here at the Voina Experience want to make sure that you are ready for Halloween 2024. So, today, we're gonna be hitting the road, and we're gonna be going to all of the local Halloween retailers, like Spirit Halloween, Party City and a few others. We're gonna be searching for the scariest Halloween decorations, animatronics, props, costumes, and everything scary that we can find, ghoulies, to make sure that you are ready for Halloween 2024. We've got a bag of Pump Eagles potions that we're gonna be leaving in our trail. The whole bag of stickers that we're gonna be passing out as well. All in promotion of the release of our latest book, ghoulies. Pump Inkles and the Lost Circus available now on Amazon. I'll drop a link to it down in the comments. Find your potions, grab your book, and let's have some fun, ghoulies. All right, ghoulies, first stop on the list today is Spirit Halloween at the Strip in Canton, Ohio. So let's go in and see what kind of creepy, scary stuff we can find. Okay, so Ghostface, he's pretty scary. So let's take a look at him real quick. All right, guys, should, should we start with like the animatronics since they're right here and then we'll go like, we'll go to costumes and stuff. Let's look around for the scariest of the animatronics. Oh, <laughs> yeah, that one's definitely scary. <laughs> Guys, truthfully, I think that the uh, giant death right here is a very scary and creepy animatronic, especially if properly lit. He is creepy. For sure. Wanda Webworth is definitely one of the creepier <laughs> animatronics from this season. I definitely think she is scary. Ghoulies, if you are looking for a scary and definitely skin crawly animatronic, check out Wanda Webworth. Yeah, what's down in there? Oh, it's a Barbara! <laughs> That's pretty weird. <laughs> Guys, I also think that Nibbles is pretty creepy with his motion tracking. I uh, don't know if it always works with the cameras, but he is definitely a creepy animatronic. It does look like his head's working at all now, so. But this guy's creepy for sure. I see you. You can't escape my gaze, so why don't you come a little closer? Hey, let's see if we can find some animatronics uh, in the front. Yeah, here's some in the boxes. Let's see if they got any creepy ones up here. Okay, we do have some Wandas, and there is a giant death right here. Um, oh, and over here is a couple of nipples. So yeah, for sure. There's a ghost swing on top of this thing. That's pretty creepy. All right, guys, let's try to find some of the creepier costumes from Spirits 2024 season. Let's go take a look. Okay guys, I think that these Poppy Playtime costumes are freaky. I mean, just look at this thing. It's got a mouth on the stomach and a mouth on the mouth. And like, I don't know, these are weird. There's eyeballs on the arm. Like, I don't know what's going on with these things, you guys, but they are weird. All right, check out the Monster Wolf Ghoulies costume. Look at the size of this mask and the mouth. That thing is huge. Plus the rest of it's actually pretty cool too. Like what do you get with this? It gives you the shirt with the attached fur, big mouth mask. So you just get the shirt and the mask. That is really freaky looking dude. <laughs> uh, if you guys are looking for something simple and creepy, this fading reaper costume is actually really cool. I'm getting a glare on it, but essentially it's just a reaper robe, but it has these really cool glowing eyes in the mask. And it's really simple, but guys, I'm always a fan of, you know, less is more. And this is actually really creepy for just being a robe with some glowing eyes, I dig it. Okay, the haunting scarecrow costume here is actually pretty creepy looking. Scarecrows, there's like a million different costumes, but this one's actually pretty creepy. I like that face. It's kind of like half skeleton, half scarecrow. It's really cool. 
Okay, here's a really cool, creepy zombie costume, you guys. And the reason why this one's cool is because you like this like brain thing going on here in the top. That's what actually makes it cool. You get the flannel shirt with the uh, attached shirts, so like the yellow, like the white one and the flannel, plus the mask, which apparently lights up according to it. So it looks like the, the brain lights up. Oh, that's really cool, you guys. I, I'm digging that one. Okay, we've got some masks back here, guys. This pig mask is freakishly weird. Uh, and not just because of, like, the blood and stuff, but check out the eyes on this one, guys. That is, like, demonic as well as <laughs> weird. In fact, all of these, like, weird, like, animal masks freak me out, you guys. Let's see what other kind of masks they got around here. None for you! Okay, this oversized clown mask is actually really creepy and weird. I mean, that thing, oh man. You see that thing coming at you in the dark. Oh, there's a zombie baby down there. <laughs> oh my gosh, nothing is scarier than my son in a horse mask with a knife. <laughs> The serial killer clown mask is actually pretty creepy. And I know I'm probably gonna pick out a lot of the clowns because these things, oh man, look at that. You know, this devil skull is pretty cool. And this like nightmare bunny mask is pretty cool. And so is this wicked scarecrow mask. I love it. Remember guys, we're only looking for the scariest stuff we can find in the store kids costumes ghoulies let's find some scary ones here's this sinister devil and it's scary but also like just really cool at the same time like i dig that suit coat i, I really so when you get, get the jacket the vest and two fur with attached devil tail latex that's super sweet the nightcrawler costume ghoulies aside from being you know the animatronic it's actually just a freaky costume just by itself even if nobody knows what it is you are I mean, it's weird. Down here, we've got this like headless zombie thing. That's pretty creepy and scary. All right, let's try to find some scary, like just, you know, decorations and stuff, guys. Okay, that hanging witch decoration, that's super freaky. That, that's so weird. It reminds me of the witch mask from Halloween 3. The creepy killer critters section is definitely filled with nothing but scary decor. All of these things are terrifying, um, especially Franklin. And we've also got scabs over here. So I mean like, and the crow and all this stuff. It's all, it's all freaky, you guys. All of the skeletons, of course, are scary. Some of the creepiest tombstones on the market are at Spirit, you guys. Look at this one. It's uh, Gordo. <laughs> and we got like the head with the eye coming out. That's freakish. I love all these hanging props. Oh man, that's weird. <laughs> this zombie silhouette is actually pretty creepy and cool. And it's only 10 bucks, you guys. Like that's a pretty cool decoration for $10 and it's scary. These bloody body bags are actually pretty freaky too. I like those. All right, ghoulies, we're gonna head to Party City next. Party City, here we come. Oh. Hey, look up there, ghoulies. There's a skill crane animatronic. Oh man, and what's this dude hanging above me? He's pretty creepy. And there's like this wall of skeletons in front of this creepy looking bookshelf. I love that bookshelf background though. Holy crap, that's awesome. That's really cool. There's a little baby leather face up there that I absolutely love. It's These uh, hanging clown decorations are actually pretty cool. If you got a circus theme going on, I'm digging those. I also really love these uh, like 
what are these scene setters here uh, like backdrops and things of jason pennywise michael myers those are creepy and this door decoration party seats oh look guys i hear there's a little michael myers one let's see if he does anything Oh, this hanging decoration. Look at the maggots and bugs all over it. Ghoulies, this is really cool webbing. Uh, I think out of all of the webbing that you can buy, this actually looks the creepiest to me. And, we should <laughs> and it's only like $11. That's cool. <laughs> what? It's demonic pizza. <laughs> no, it's demented pizza. Demented. Or Ew, Abigail? That's not Abigail. <laughs> What the heck? Harrison is turning into a monster? Ooh, I love this Roddy Scotty posable skeleton. Guys, and this thing feels like really high quality. Like this is not just some flimsy thing. This is, oh man, this is really cool. Check him out. Like that is awesome. He's a fully posable skeleton, five feet. He's new for this season, $54.99. He's awesome. Pink skeletons. Here's a pretty scary looking butcher kit, guys. I'm really liking that. Ooh, this Dark King costume is pretty cool, you guys. Like, it's really detailed with all this stuff. It gives you the shirt, the cape, the crown, and the mask. These other items, of course, you have to assemble yourself. Ooh, what is this thing? Illusion Ghoul? What in the holy heck is that? Oh my gosh. And this hooded horror costume is actually pretty cool, and it lights up and everything, plus it glows in the dark. Really cool. These floating skull candles, those are wicked cool. Oh, and I like this squashed pumpkin, or what is this, flaming pumpkin? Can't really see the flames, if it's flaming, here's another one, let's see. No, but it's still really cool. Oh, look at the inflatable pumpkin patch. I love that. Guys, they have these trunk or treat car decorating kits. How cool is that? I've been seeing these pop up at a lot of places. I like this table runner that looks like creepy moss. And then also this backdrop is really weird. All right, guys, that's it for Party City. Next stop, Party Place. Yeah, he's definitely one of the creepiest. Our main show is about to begin. Bring the kids, bring grandma, bring the whole family. They'll eat anybody. <laughs> Feeling a little lightheaded? Grab a refreshment and a snack it. And know that the I mean, yeah, he's creepy because, like, rumor. So look at his teeth. <laughs> This one is definitely a creepy animatronic. Like, cause she's like all hunched over and stuff. I have been waiting for you for a very long time. So it kind of reminds me of like Zelda from Pet Cemetery. I mean, not with the lantern and all that, but just like it's all hunched over. Like you look, I'm looking straight at it. And then she just like keeps talking and talking and talking. It's definitely scary. And then this witch is also creepy with holding the baby like over the cauldron. And then... Like, it's just unsettling. Like, her dress is all old looking and weird. And she's got bones around her neck. Ah, and the kids screaming. Like, you know, that's a creepy animatronic for sure. Hey, you wanna know what's not scary? This piece of crap. <laughs> all right, this decoration, this hanging decoration is pretty scary looking. You can't even like really see its face. Like, that's really weird. All right, this like, clown scarecrow thing is really weird looking you guys 
What? The skulls are cool. And this like two-headed bat statue is pretty cool. And that's like a full statue. Like that's not, you know, like a hollow thing. That's, oh, they got this pumpkin bones. What? That is cool. Pumpkin bones. Pumpkins don't have bones. This lantern is pretty creepy, guys. See? Yeah, that's pretty cool. I like those lanterns. Now this like hanging clown demon thing looks pretty scary. <laughs> oh, look here, guys. We got a leather face. Leather face is creepy. What are these Halloween crypt windows? What's that? That looks super nostalgic. Like, what is this company, Chiller? What is this? I got eighty dollars. Take an additional fifty percent off, so it's only forty dollars. But what is it? What is this? Everything in here is scary, you guys. Everything is bat coming at you. Ew, this witch is pretty creepy. Okay, the six foot reaper is pretty scary looking. Jumping spider, of course, is creepy. So is this garden gnome, you guys. What the heck? This guy's creepy looking. He doesn't work. I just tried him, but he's creepy looking. Okay, this uh, female phantom inflatable 10 foot, that's pretty scary looking. And so is this pumpkin inflatable, seven and a half feet. They've also got a goose face inflatable that lights up. That's pretty cool. The little head in the jar is pretty scary. A box of hands and then of course all of the butcher food. I'd love to get a display like that set up sometime, ghoulies. And of course we have the giant uh, pumpkin version of rattles back here and a skeleton, which is creepy. What? Where am I hearing this mysterious voice coming from? Oh, the cemetery bride costume, that's pretty creepy looking. Hey guys, they have got a uh, Killer Clowns from Outer Space Fat So <laughs> costume. But that thing is creepy looking. Hey, look at this creepy clown, guys. It has like these weird, like extendable arms or something. That's really weird and scary. Okay, the garden gnome zombie thing. That is the most terrifying thing I've ever seen. <laughs> oh yeah, the zombie skeleton is so Super creepy, you guys. We've got a Dead by Daylight Scorched Ghost Face costume, and that thing is creepy. Here's one that's up without the glare. Look at that thing, that's weird. Oh, man. Yeah, this is weird looking, guys. It's a gargoyle costume. Look how cool that is. Oh, man, look, guys. This costume is so scary and weird. They actually have to put it into a box. Look at this. You get this jumpsuit. You get the attached collar with this big mouth mask. Oh, man. And they have it in a box. <laughs> and, guys, they have got, like, a whole just section of creepy makeup and effects here. I mean, I mean, I mean it's just, like, a whole, like, this is probably the biggest makeup section that you can get in any place, including, like, Spirit. I mean, this is a huge section of makeup and effects all upstairs and it's all creepy and fun yeah that pitchfork is actually pretty cool but like this is a cool looking pitchfork because it's like indented instead of just straight like that's actually pretty cool i like that what in the heck is this thing it looks like there was something or maybe like a candy dish or something but it's cool looking it looks like a tombstone or something i like that All right, ghoulies, on to our last stop. All right, ghoulies, we're also gonna check out some things at Walmart because, hey, you know, Walmart's everywhere. Walmart. All right, we've got some creepy baby masks here. 
What is down here? Is that a, a pig? Ew. Oh, check these out, guys. This is not necessarily scary, but I just want to show you. They have these Among Us costumes here at Walmart for you Among Us fans. <laughs> All right, this werewolf inflatable looming over me is actually kind of creepy for an inflatable because check it out, Ghoulies. He's got like real fur on his feet. That's pretty cool. Oh, yes, Ghoulies. Jason t shirt, Michael t shirt. And Freddy t-shirt, awesome. There's also a Beetlejuice one too. <laughs> the bleeding Grim Reaper costume is kind of cool. As is this weird clown. It has this stringy hair, I like that. Ghoulies, look! This jack-o'-lantern monster crawler looks a little bit like our original design of Pumpinkles. If you don't know what I'm talking about, make sure you pick up our book to find out. It's on Amazon now. Halloween cocoon corpse is always a creepy decoration. I really like the jigsaw inflatable, that's creepy. This light up ghost, not necessarily meant to be creepy, I don't think, but it has a really cool Halloween look to it. I just like it. There's this like cool animated hanging reaper decoration that's pretty scary. Even better, ghoulies, check out the Dr. Squash Halloween themed soaps. There's this werewolf wash, Count Sudzula, Brick of the Dead, and there's even this drunken pumpkin one. Those are really cool. <laughs> We've even got some Halloween themed fireworks, you guys. That's new. <laughs> All right, ghoulies, well, that about does it for our search for the scariest Halloween costumes and decor from 2024. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Make sure that you're hitting that subscribe button so that you do not miss our next video. And until next time, I will catch you later, ghoulies.